Medicine and Appliances, we've talked a lot about the If This and That app, but it's usually in reference to fun or more novel applications. Actually, there are a lot of practical uses for it, too. I'm Megan Woolerton with a weather-related how-to. This lamp behind me is red. We'll get to that in a second, but here's how you start. So this recipe involves the RSS feed as the IFT and your Philips Hue lights as the THAT. What you'll do is go to the National Weather Service and search for the RSS feed that gives alerts in your area. You can find alerts that are nationwide, you can search by state, and you can even search by county to get really, really specific updates. So just go to your scrolling list and select RSS feed as your IF, and then click on New Feed Item and add the URL for the RSS feed you want. I selected New York because there are some flash flood warnings in the area and I knew that there would be some alerts. So I added that URL, then you hit next and then you select your Philips Hue bulbs as your that. And then you can really do whatever you want. You can have your lights flash, you can have them change color. You can't set it to blink and change color, which I wish it could do, but it's still a good warning in case there's something going on. So this lamp has a Philips Hue bulb inside and I programmed it to work with this recipe. And if you have multiple bulbs, you can select all of them, you can select some of them, or just one, whatever you prefer. And that's really it. You've selected your RSS feed for your area, you've selected your Philips Hue lights, and told them what you want them to do in the event of an alert. Just hit finish, and you've created your recipe. So now every time there's an alert in Niagara, New York, my light will turn red. So while there are a lot of novel ways to use IFT, this is one practical way. I'm Megan Woolerton for CNET.